New developments on the breaking news in Balt Springs. We've just confirmed that no one was killed in that explosive grass fire, but dozens of families saw their homes incinerated. We've also learned what may have sparked the fire. The city manager tells us a landscaping crew was cutting the grass on a nearby field. The mower may have struck a metal object and set off sparks. Flames spread quickly, damaging 26 homes. Nine of those are destroyed in the Spring Ridge neighborhood. That fire now contained. Balt Springs is right near Mesquite inside the Dallas County line. Matt Howerton has been reporting on the ground all evening and Matt, you've seen quite a bit of damage and heartbreak today. Yeah, Chris, I'm standing in the very field where this fire began. Blackened grass is just all around me. It's been such an all out effort from multiple agencies around DFW to contain the spread of this thing today. And sometimes a big blaze has a very small beginning. I want to show you some video that we just got. This video was taken during the infancy of this fire. It was just a brush fire in the field that I'm standing in. Hadn't touched any homes just yet. And it goes to show you how something so small can spread so fast in these kind of conditions. It is a charred mess. I've never seen anything like this, nor do I want to see it now. One that stopped the mayor of Balt Springs. I do feel for the homeowners and we're doing everything within our power. In her tracks. So that we all somehow, some way, make it through this. From the air, a front row center seat to devastation. A small grass fire started along this service road on I-20 West, chomping its way towards the Spring Ridge neighborhood, creeping into backyards, then ripping homes apart. Completely demolished, burnt to the ground. City officials say at least 26 homes are damaged. Of those, nine burned to the ground. The others damaged by water, fire, or smoke. The cause, a heartbreaker. And from when we understand there was a spark that started the whole thing from the mowers and it just spread to the houses. A crew was mowing this field when they hit something metal. Sparks flew and because the grass is so dry, a recipe for disaster unfolded. City manager Susan Clues could see the smoke from City Hall. And when I called the uh, fire chief, I said, do you know there's a fire out there? And he said, yes, man, everyone is on their way. The spread of the fire contained just before 7 p.m. Still, fire crews will stay here well into Tuesday morning, monitoring homes, hot spots and the area. Monday night, the sun setting on a tragic scene, one that was paved by one of the driest and warmest summers in DFW. We'll live to see tomorrow. In Balch Springs, I'm Matt Howerton.